here we go. You've got Dogs Johnson on your left. You've got OJ on your right. Here we go. Just gumbin right in to Dreamland. Got the Battle of Wisconsin and Indiana here in this grand final set. And right now, both players just kind of slapping each other. All right, OJ has dogs off stage. Good immediate up B to avoid the spring and force him off. OJ now getting at a disadvantage. Ooh, opting for the homing attack instead, going for the short charge. Good catch on that back air. Dogs will take the first stock here from what was looking like a long stretch of advantages and disadvantages. OJ Thou trying to find a retort. Doesn't quite get the spring. A very nice fast fall into that second jump. Dogs keeping that stock alive. Good SDI as well on the drill. All right, that back throw should be more than enough to kill there. OJ evening the stock, but Dogs was getting a good amount of percents, and he was really doing a lot of good spacing to get a lot of opportunities for damage. It'll be interesting to see how he can keep it up in this next stock here. Good pressure there with a the double dare. Not enough to break shield and not enough to fully get a good amount of damage. But with OJ already at 114, just a bit more, and he should be able to secure the sock. That back throw sending him back into disadvantage again, catching the homing attack low with the back air. He kept his jump, but that back air with the tipper this time is going to secure the sock. Ooh, OJ just going in. I feel like that's like one of the biggest chump checks in this game uh, from a remix character. It's just... <laughs> All right, you killed Sonic. You go to the ledge, just kind of waiting for him to come back, and he immediately runs off and fares you. But as we see there, it's not only limited to that. Catching dogs in the air, he's able to find the fair spike and take his stock, even at two apiece now. Oh yeah, I'll make sure to up make sure everything's updated in a second. I just have to go and go over to the computer on a different screen. I don't have the the admin pr privileges for the Smash GG. Apologies. Oh my gosh, dogs just desperately rolling out of there, trying to get out of the way. Both players refusing to lose this next stock. Oh, good catch on the homing attack. I definitely think that was a little a little too premature there from OJ to go for that. He was still kind of close to the stage, so he didn't need to. But Dogs was like, I see it coming. I expect it to be coming. I'm ready for it. And that spacing for the dare tipper, very nice. Oh, both players teching around the same time. OJ with a slight advantage. Good combative up B, though. Sending super far by getting the tipper. Good grab, though, from the OJ, sending dogs really far out. Good up B there, but not quite enough yet. Still able to live. Dogs again trying to recover. It looks like OJ's trying to do, like, Marth Killer, but since he doesn't have the light shield, he's using the spring, but it's not quite working out yet. But he's able to secure the stock. Last stock for both players, but OJ with a big percentage lead to have to bring down. Oh, nice catch with the tilt. Good interrupt, though, by OJ with the, with the jab. Good grab there, the back throw, not, oh, it is enough. 
just barely covering that entirety of the stage. And Dogs taking game one. But that was looking really good there from OJ. He was playing really tight there. A little bit more, and I definitely think he's got this. Oh, we're using stages? All right, Dogs is banned, Smashville. We're going to see. I've got the stage list over there if you need it. All right, we're seeing the switch to Cap, maybe. We're seeing the switch to Falcon instead of Marth. Oh, and we're going to be going to Goomba Road. All right, best stage in the game. All right, here we go. Now it'll be interesting to see, I think I mentioned it earlier when we saw Pika and Kirby here, I think Falcon can definitely have a strong showing on this. Just working from center up to those other top platforms on the right and left side of the stage, I think can be really strong. On the other hand, it gives Sonic such a good striking point. Oh, Cat clipping him with the spring there, just a little bit off from that Falcon punch, but it works out, OJ taking that first stock. I think for Sonic on this stage, he can really use those two top platforms as strike, like a strike base. He gets so much off of just being able to run off straight from there, but also gets the added height of the recovery, as well as being able to recover onto those platforms that not a lot of characters get to utilize as much. But Dog's able to secure the stock there and immediately coming back on his second one, OJ taking a good amount of damage here. The bicycle kick for good measure just missed, barely missing the dare though. And that secures the stock as well. Another good conversion off the up airs into the up B. OJ trying to find some nice damage off the up airs. Gets the back throw on the top plat. Unfortunately, it gave him a lot of space to recover because those platforms are so high. Oh, just barely missing the double, nair, uh, double fair conversion. All right, we're seeing the rolls. Just barely missing the springs again. I'm surprised to see him here, there. I don't feel like we were seeing them too much in his last few sets, and they don't seem to be working out too well. The hug up at the top of the blast zone is going to take another stock. OJ, a bit lost for a comeback here. Oh, nice catch on the up air. Not enough to kill, though. At 102, OJ desperately trying to make it back. The bicycle kick on the homing attack. And one more time, Dogs Johnson is on his way to possibly win the remix singles bracket without even dropping the set. This could be his third tournament win in two, technically three days because we're now in the morning of Sunday for everyone here on the East Coast. All right, get a counter pick back to Dreamland. We're seeing the switch to Wolf, and he gets the counter pick on the music. Now that is epic. All right, we haven't really seen the Wolf too much. Mostly seen the Sonic, so we're gonna have to see if this Wolf is what he needs, what OJ needs to finally turn this around and not only take this next game, but to possibly bring him this first set, carrying him with the shine to the dare. We saw him use that against Antoine and it was working really well. All right, those up airs carrying Wolf all the way to the top blast zone and more than enough damage to kill. About even here. Oh, good catch with the back air. Not quite able to catch the drift though. Just a little too high with that Nair. But Dogs getting a whole bunch of damage. Doesn't get the reverse Nair though. The reverse fair, unfortunate. Would have been really neat though. OJ though, kid trying to get these falling back airs. Adding the pressure with the lasers. Oh, trying to grab him there instead of throwing out a hurt box or hit box. Both players not quite able to secure the stock. Doesn't quite get the bicycle kick, but gets the second one. The up B, not enough distance to get up there. No. 
Oh, doesn't get the jab grab, just only gets a solo grab. Dogs getting the... Oof. He is doing so well in this advantage state. That's another stock gone. OJ on his last stock, possibly of the tournament. All right, that's up smash to Nair, another up smash, the up air to the dare, and that's it. Dogs with the quick 3-0, completing the three-peat. Damn. <laughs> I hope that picked up in the mic. I'm going to make sure to crank that up in the VOD if it didn't. Congratulations to Dogs, but also congratulations to OJ for an insane bracket run. I don't even blame him if he was finally getting worn out from it all. That was intense. Oh. But thank you, everyone, for stopping by. Indy winning all three of the Florida brackets during this weekend. And congratulations, Dog Johnson. Congrats to Shears, who also won the doubles bracket with him. And thank you, everyone who came out to compete. Everyone who stopped by in the stream, I very much appreciate it. I am going to be off now because I have to hurry and run. But thank you all so much for watching. I will have these up as soon as I can sometime this week. I appreciate all the kind words. Um, catch me next time whenever we announce the next Oceanfront. If not, somewhere else, at least in the VODs again. And um, have an excellent good night.